Hey guys, it's the Solar Clock and today so this is Monster Legends Guide's video I'm going to be telling you guys how to get maze points for the new maze. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so first of all, we're going to go over the easier ways and then the more difficult ways. But the more difficult ways are definitely the better ways, so stick around till the end of the video in order to hear those. But let's go ahead and go over the easier, less good ways first. Alright, so the first way is going to be collecting a gold. You just want to click collect all after you click one, and then you want to just spam one, and then you'll get all the maze coins. Just make sure you spam one after clicking collect all so that you make sure to get them all. And then food is kind of similar to that. You just go ahead and grow big food, and then you collect it. And then you also want to grow one small one, and then once you collect the small one, after you collect the big ones and click collect all, you will actually go and get all of the maze coins. So that is very important. Definitely make sure to grow the small one as well. And then for the gold, definitely make sure to spam it a little bit before or after. And then for breeding and hatching, you want to click on breeding event. There are no breeding events going on right now, so I can't really show you, but there will be one going on when this video comes out. So you just want to click breeding event, and then you want to go and breed any of the golden background monsters, and then you'll get maze coins. Just make sure the monsters have the golden background. If they have the silver background, they will not give you maze coins. Or they will, but they'll give you less maze coins. So just make sure to make the golden background monsters. And that goes for both breeding and hatching. And then you can go ahead and also feed your monsters. If I can find an example, I will go and show you guys that as well. So just click on any monster and you want to go ahead and click kind of slowly. You don't want to hold it down. If you hold it down, you might miss the maze coins under the food. So just make sure to click it slowly while you are go ahead and actually trying to get the maze coins. And all of the methods that I just named can be done every four hours so make sure to log in every four hours in order to do all those and then another one that can be done every four hours is multiplayer you can go and fight in multiplayer you can do two battles every four hours for 15 maze coins each for a total of 30 every four hours so yeah make sure to do those as well and now let's get on to the more difficult ways. The first one is going to be Monsterwood. It isn't really difficult, but it's just better. You can go ahead and click on Monsterwood and you can watch ads. It will be right here on mobile. I'm on PC, so there are no ads, but on mobile, it'll be right here. And you just want to watch ads. You get like 30 maze coins an ad and you can just leave it running in the background watching ads. It's not really difficult at all. It's actually probably the easiest way because you don't even have to be playing the game. So yeah, just go ahead and do that. Watch ads in Monsterwood. And then the next way is going to be through the dungeon. It'll be in resource dungeons. So you just want to go in here, there will be a maze coins dungeon, and then you can just go ahead and fight in the dungeon, you can get 1,500 free maze coins. It's not too difficult, but it does take obviously a longer time than anything else, because you do actually have to be interacting with the game and fighting in the dungeon. So yeah, make sure to do the dungeon before it ends. And yeah, those are all of the ways to get maze coins. Let me know down in the comments what your favorite method is to get maze coins, and how you are going to do it, and what you are going to be trying to get out of the maze. And I'll see you guys in the next one, over to like, share, and subscribe, goodbye.